Greetings and welcome. Today we'll be looking at this UAP Ministries that Daddy Bailey and the Apostle speaks of this on many occasions. Now many may not know him or may not be familiar with the church, but here's a little clip of some of the things that take place there. First of all, Daddy Bailey um, is being wheeled in on his little chariot thingy there. Um, why? It's because he cannot walk on his own for a long period of time. Now, as you can see, some men are helping him out of his little chariot. And this is the man that they're praising. This is the man that they're worshiping. This is the man that they're taking for their God, a God that they have to help. They have to assist in simply walking. Now, let's take a look. <laughs> I ask the question, is this church a called church? Well, some of the things that they do there in terms of baptizing is they basically go in the street, street and drenched the people with fire hose. And that would be considered to be baptizing. Then Daddy Grace would welcome them with a wave of his four inch fingernails. I'll definitely we will be putting a clip of that in this. And uh, another thing that they also do is preach in caskets. I'll also put a picture of that for you to see. So yes, they are a cult church. Ignorance of cult followers. Yeah. When you make your leader the Messiah. Oh yes. When you make your leader the reincarnation of Christ. That's right. When you make your leader God Almighty Himself. That's right. When you make your leader higher than God. Higher. When you bow to him. Pray to him. All the songs in your temple. In your congregation. Is in the name of your leader. Yeah. Are you getting me? Oh yes. There's an organization here in America. It's called House of Prayer for all the people. Turn me. The House of Prayer for all the people founded by Bishop C.M. Grace. He was better known as Sweet Daddy Grace. Now you know that's a false prophet because a man of God don't wear such a title. No. Sweet Daddy. <laughs> He's dead now in a Christless grave. He'll soon be ushered to hell. That's right. But while he lived, his hair, he allowed to grow further than his shoulders. He let his nails grow long, two and three inches long, until they twist. All the songs that were sung in the house of prayer for all people, they removed all the words that had the name Jesus. Now, you're watching Pastor Gina Jennings, and to get more teaching from this, from him, please visit the description box down below. He is talking about the UAP Church and uh, the cult things that the pastors or the preachers there are doing. Now, let's continue to listen. Um, for years, Jesus is mine, and the choir say, oh yes, he's mine. So they switched it. And the whole choir sang it, Sweet Daddy is mine. Sweet Daddy is mine. Everywhere I go, everywhere I be, Sweet Daddy is mine. See, that's coldism. That's coldism. Only one deserves to be prayed to, sung about, wish up. That's God. That's God. Are you listening? That's right. God is 
jealous. That's right. Oh, yeah. Hear the old troublemaker now, because I'm pretty sure, but we, we, we haven't been up here long, and I guarantee, thumbs down already. Yes, yes, oh yes. Right. Pointing where they're going. That's right. That's right. Yes, oh, yes, wonderful. That's right. 20th chapter of the book of Exodus. Book I of say Exodus. God is jealous. That's right. Human family. That's right. Your bishop, you should never make a song about him. No. He's unworthy. Your bishop. You should never bow before him. I want every Catholic heathen in the world to hear this. You that are watching throughout Rome. Now, these are all signs of a cult. You're worshiping or bowing down to your preacher or minister. These are signs that you're worshiping in a cult um, church. You soap. He had to brush his teeth or take them out and put them in a jar. That's right. So they can soak overnight. That's he gets sick yeah. and he dies. He dies. No man That's right. should we ever bow to. No. No man. If you honor that man, let your honor come in compliance with God's eternal word. That's right. No, that is clear to understand. That's it from us here at Old Time Religion. Thank you for watching. Until next time, remember to like, share, and subscribe to the channel.